family, friends, classmates, neighbors. It's so good to have everyone here today. Kaylee, I've known you for eight years. Now of those eight years, we were just friends for only about three months. <laughs> and while people have asked for a while when we'd be getting married, we knew that today was the perfect day. And about a year and a half ago, I built up the courage to look your dad in the eye and say, I want to marry your daughter. And when I look back and think about all we've ex experienced together, it's hard to imagine it getting any better. But then I think about where we are and where we're going, and I am beside myself to be standing up here looking at you. I'm so happy to be with you and proud that I get to call you my wife. But it's not going to be easy. There'll be challenges and roadblocks, and I'll need a pretty good companion on this mission. I promise to love you and be your rock. Kaylee, I've known you for eight years. And when eight years becomes 80, people might ask, after all this time? And I'll answer, always. Paul, there are things we do right now that I want to vow to continue to do because I believe they are examples of our unique relationship and love. I promise to continue to match you on accident. You look out for me, support me in everything I do and want to do. You make me confident and you push me to be a better person. And I feel so completely loved when you look at me with that smile and those eyes. So I promise to make, always make you feel loved with my words, my facial expressions, my gestures, and anything else I can think of. Finally, for the more traditional stuff, Paul, I vow to be faithful to you, to love and cherish you through anything and everything. I vow to grow with you and be your partner in life, and I vow to be your best friend. I am so excited to marry you, Paul Garvin. I love you. By the power vested in me, by the state of Oregon and in Hill County, it is my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Paul. It gives me great pleasure to present for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Paul and Kaylee Garaventa. I took a picture of her pitching on the Kansas City Royals mound when I was playing, and on family day I got a picture of her, and I show all my scout buddies her picture. <laughs> and I say this is the number one pick every year. Um, special thanks to Larry and Michelle and all the Cassians and the Todds for wel welcoming me into the family. Um, it's so nice just to come day one feel like I'm part of the group. No awkwardness whatsoever. Can't say the same for the Partons or the Garaventas. I'm sure Kaylee felt awful going in. So many people, but now she's part of the family and I couldn't be happier.